Hey. Coming to play a little bit of Minecraft with you. I got a, uh, we got a survival realm going on here. And I got us vanilla BD craft. And I cranked it to its maximum resolution. So it's going to look incredible. Uh, everybody on the realm agrees that uh, we love BD craft very, very much. A beautiful texture pack in every possible way. Custom UI and all that. Um, it's old school, you know, it's not like it's a new texture pack or anything, but it's surprising how uh, often you, you don't see it. Uh, I, I think it's because the price tag's like eight or nine dollars, maybe even a little more or less or something, but it's expensive basically as far as texture packs go. Uh, but uh, I went and got us it because it's amazing and I think everybody's gonna really like it. So we're gonna keep that on the realm for a little bit. We've, we've enjoyed uh, a few texture packs over time. I keep changing it up every now and then just so that everybody can sort of check out fun new texture packs and stuff. But I'll tell you something, I don't want to mess with people's builds on this realm. It's a, This realm is small, it's only about 10 people. Uh, but um, yeah, I just don't want, to, uh, I don't want to destroy people's builds by changing everything all the time, right? So what I'm going to do is run vanilla BD craft at its highest resolution with you guys. And I hope you really enjoy it. It looks incredible. Today I'm going to continue working downstairs because I really need some meat farms going on. Uh, and I need wool for carpets, you know, that kind of stuff, right? So let's just jump on in. So let's talk about, let's do a little texture pack appreciation first of all. Check that out. Doesn't that look incredible? So BD Craft, uh, the sort of standard BD Craft, really drastically changes a lot of things. Um, it's very cartoony, and it's nice, you know, but the villagers look really weird, for example. That's something that's not great about it, in my opinion. Uh, some people may really like it, but they look very alien. Um, to me, I'm not a huge fan of them. But uh, Vanilla tries to stay true to the original Minecraft while well, giving it sort of a, a, a BD Craft touch, eh? So, this is a dark oak tree here. Some piggies. So you can see that it's 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 looking close to what it's supposed to look like, you could say, but also just a little, little tighter, right? Nice flowers there. Yeah, awesome. Really excited about this. I know everybody in the realm is going to love it. Uh, we all, we all love the original Minecraft. Look at this 100. I still love this thing. I don't want to take it down. Looks like I need to finish that pillar. I, I really, I didn't want stone here. I was going to do wood with a with a stone base. Um, but maybe I should fill it in. No, it does have to be wood. And what is this thing doing here, eh? Don't need that there. Actually, this could be downstairs, eh, guys? Because I've got a fancy little farm going on down there. I really could just, uh, you know, plant it. It doesn't need water nearby. I know that much. So that's kind of cool, right? Yeah, look at this room. It's incredible, guys. I love it. This is an early morning stream for me. Don't usually come on this early. I hope everybody's having a good morning. I did, uh, I've missed uh, streaming with you guys, so I did want to just pop in when I have the time, and as it is right now, I have the time, so I'm doing it. I hope I'm not waking anybody up with notifications or anything. Or hey, maybe maybe you want the wake up. Maybe say that's a good wake up. Yeah, 
This is all getting filled in with dirt here. After this stream, I'm going to be streaming Mountain, um, which is, uh, well, it's a picture of a mountain with some nice music. Uh, in case anybody wants a little bit of something relaxing, something uh, interesting to look at. I'm very curious how it will go. Uh, mountain is a game where you don't really know what's going to happen next. If it's a game at all, it's more like an experience. See, all this is getting filled in with dirt. All of it. So I'm just going to clean it out. I keep trying to heal this pick, so anything that gives me experience, I try. <laughs> I try and whack something with it, you know. Texture pack appreciation. There's some potatoes. They look great, eh? Love it. See if I can get this little section without this pick breaking. Yeah, and there he goes. Yeah, that's a lot. So I started grass in the very, very corner. I put my grass block here. And so I, there was a little experiment to see how long it takes, right? It's going to grow. And I got a feeling once it hits these areas, because it'll be able to widen out, it'll grow much, you know, exponentially faster, right? But for now, it's just going to be in that little area. It'll, it'll, it'll come out eventually. Oh, let's grab some dirt while we're at it. Got a chest of dirt right here. Let's see how far two of those go. Here's a question for you. Does grass grow under? Will this block grow grass because they're growing grass? See what I'm saying? There's a there's something on top of it. enough good stuff might as well grab my silk touch pickaxe and move that shulker box there I suppose I could embed it in a wall that could be kind of nice make a little sort of shelf for them right something like that been playing Valorant. Uh, I'm not very good at it. Gotta be honest with you guys. My CSGO game was uh, slightly less than average. That's eh, probably average, to be honest. Give myself some credit. I have clocked uh, some time playing CSGO. And that game is very similar to CSGO, and so I'm playing it, and I'm doing it. But uh, it's tricky. And there's people already in the closed beta, um, there's already people who are quite good at it and have figured out a lot of angles and tricks and things. 
problem with Valorant for me is that it takes 45 minutes or so to play one match. That's a lot of time for a guy like me. Because I happen to have things to do around here, so, you know. <laughs> Look at this gravel block. It's awesome. See, you can put down gravel as a block, but in certain texture packs, it looks good. So you can call it a decorative block. See? That looks incredible. Something gurgling down there, bad, eh? It wants out. All right, let's get rid of this extra cobble here. Keeping all of this, I'll keep this one. Uh, keep that one. This is going to look great, guys. Uh, one more. Let's move that shulker box for sure. I'll use this one. That. Just like that. Probably have to dig all this up again to put another farm in here, but I'm not going to cry about that right now. Just want to fill it in, get that grass growing. There we go. <laughs> Alright, so nice. That is going to go crazy with grass in the future here. Once this breaks out of this, and this shulker's move now. Ooh, look at this. I might extend that. I want these to match, right? Does it line up over here? It does. Alright. and then move this just make it just that much longer and I don't have enough of that excuse me Just like this. Looks like I need a little bit more polished uh, diorite. Polished diorite. Like this. Is four gonna do it? This is this is this is me in Minecraft. This is classic me in Minecraft where I'm like, I think I got enough, and then I show up and it's not enough. And I know everybody can be like, yeah, that happens to me too, but no. It happens to me in a just an uncomfortable amount of times. Nope. Alright, 
where does this chest live then, eh, guys? Maybe just shove it in the corner for now. Yeah, that's what we'll do. Something like that. Okay, so now that's extended to that. That's supposed to be, um... What was I, what was I gonna grow there, guys? That was, uh... Don't want bamboo here. It's too big. Don't need that much bamboo. Really, really don't. Pumpkins. Thanks, Taco. Good morning. It's really, it's pretty early for my stream today, but I, I have the time right now to do it, and I haven't seen you guys in a while. Taco, I put um, vanilla BD craft on this on the uh, old server there thing, so the realm's looking really tight, buddy. Yeah, it's it's high high quality. We may just stick with it. You know what I mean? We've had some fun changing texture packs, but I don't want to change them often at all. Like I, I don't want to mess with people's builds and just mines and things like that. So I'd really like us to be consistent. And honestly, this is you know. Come on, you, how can you possibly go wrong, right? Look at the seamless, uh, like those blocks as they join up. Look how seamless that is. It just looks amazing. We'll go something like this. See? farm goes there just little stuff guys you don't you know you don't need one billion carrots right that kind of thing so it's no big deal to just just do a few I'm actually gonna punch out this dirt little things like this it's gonna look great for now. Alright, let's unload the pockets here. glad to see this here because the last texture pack the gravel and the andesite you couldn't you couldn't tell the difference in a lot of ways it just it's got a small block on a on a um item frame that is you know this looks really obvious right so there's cobble so you know, they all look very distinct andesite and uh diorite look pretty similar actually but diorite looks nice and white there so i'm good with that and here as well as the blocks it was, it was very difficult to tell the difference so Pretty happy about that. I'll put this polished die right in here. Let's put this pick back. In a place of honor, because it's such a nice pick. <laughs> Uh, just having a good morning, guys. I hope you guys are having a good morning too. If you're new to the stream, please say hi in the chat. We all we would all love to meet you. It's as easy as just saying hello. Yeah. See, here's a stone hoe, and I'll make another one of those. And we're actually gonna put those um in that chest. See. Just so it's ready for farmland when we get there, right? Yeah, and this is looking pretty good right now. Where do I put the meat farms? I didn't want this hallway getting any longer. Um, don't want it to be a pain in the butt to go get meat and leather and wool and you know what I mean? Did kind of want this stuff underground though, so what I was thinking of doing is knocking this wall back just 
really tough to say, actually. This needs to have two more dark oaks. At least one more. The acacia and jungle all go under here. I won't know how big this room is until I do that. See? It's a problem in my life. <laughs> Come see. It looks like there's enough room, but yeah, those acacias, they are big. And the dark oak, of course, they're huge, right? Maybe... I should plant an acacia thing right here. This is what I should do. It might encroach on the dark oak world over here, but we'll see. All right, I want to give lots of space here. Two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven. Knock it out. Is that a lot of space? It sure is. Jeez. One goes here. Same. Leave two spaced. Yeah, this texture pack is gorgeous, guys. Look at this. It's just a dirt block, but look at it. It's so nice. I love it. I really hope that everybody in the realm likes it too. Mm. Right on. <laughs> Right on, Taco. I'm going to keep the resolution set at 256. Um, I don't know if you guys can... Hold on a second. Let's take a look, okay? I don't know if you guys can turn up or down resolution when you join. Like, uh, if, you, if you're having trouble, let's say for some reason, you guys could actually just turn it up or down don't know yeah I think I want to move that just there well not there this has that See, because that's two down, see, two down. But that's gonna leave three wide. This is, it's too early for this. <laughs> it's just kinda too early for this kind of thinking here. But if I do this, it's gonna look tight. I know that much. All right, you know what? What's it gonna hurt, right? Can move it later if I really don't like the outcome I can always move it <laughs> oh yeah mr. moose it looks like a stage four but without all the safety nonsense everywhere <laughs> it's funny because it's true I want to I don't want to do a, I will be doing an actual stage three and stage four I'm gonna put in this realm I'm going to make an archaeology site near my house. Just a place to actually, like, take viewers and show them and teach them things, you know? I was also going to have a contest with the realm members. I'm going to make an archaeology site. I'm going to, yeah, and I'm going to bury a bunch of stuff. And we won't know where it is. Even I probably won't. I'll, I'll lose it all, right? But, um, yeah, the idea is that people will have to dig a square. And I'm going to do it with... Uh, like really dent really hard rock and you have to punch it out or the shovel you have to shovel it out but it's going to be like it takes a while to dig the square you know <laughs> maybe even take some injuries while it, while it's happening <laughs> see what do i hate about this nothing that's four acacia trees 
and four is fine, isn't it? You know what I mean? They don't all have to look like a perfect... Uh... Yeah, I think it'll be okay. Now, I know I have some acacia or something somewhere. Let's go take a look. It's probably my chest. Like everything else in my life. See here? There we go. We are definitely planting this. Something like that. How's your morning, Moose? I woke up and played Valorant for a couple matches and it was too much for me. It was a little stressed out. Shouldn't shouldn't do that in the mornings. Yep. Yep. In all honesty, um, being very honest with you, you should enjoy this time. It's not often in life that you don't have somebody breathing down your neck and why aren't you working? Why aren't you working harder? Why aren't you working? Do some work. Work. Work all the time. Work. Why don't you do some work? Get up in the morning. There's an alarm clock. What's the alarm clock for? Work. It's not normal, man. There's a there's an old hippie inside of me. And I'm actually catching up to him in age. <laughs> but uh, my old hippie inside of me says, like, it's not what life's all about, man. You are not supposed to work. Work is not life. All right, good enough. See? That one's just going to get one for now. Man, that should grow. That should grow. All right, in the dark oak. See how big... See how ridiculous this tree is? It is total wide. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. It's eight wide. Like, come on, right? Okay, so I'm right under it. That's this. Leave a space of two. I'm just going to mark this. That's where it starts growing the next one. So it needs to be eight wide. One, two, three, four. This should be okay. But I'm gonna shift it over. Hey, t TikToks, man. Good to see you. Hold on a second. I gotta, I gotta say something proper to you. Good morning, buddy. Good to see you again, man. You have an excellent stream, and I hope uh, I find the time to pop in regularly. Um, I just want to say that personally to you, man. I love the show, and I think you do a great job, and I think you're playing some extremely high quality Minecraft. It's just, it's too complex for me. I think you know, <laughs> but uh, I love it, man. So welcome. Thanks for coming back. And uh, anybody who is watching here, some of my uh, regulars, uh, give TikToks in the, in the chat there. Give them a quick click in the chat. Give them a follow. Uh, catch, a, catch his show. It is a fantastic. I believe he's playing Windcraft, I think it's called. Um, just absolutely gorgeous Minecraft, and it's very uh, interesting and technical, I guess you could say, right? Yeah, it's, it's, it's Windcraft, yeah. Good old Java. Um, this place is a bedrock realm for a number of reasons. We've got players from uh, playing on Xbox, got a player on a Nintendo Switch, myself on a PC. Um, sometimes I like to jump into my realm on my, t on my Android tablet, uh, sitting in bed, you know, with the wifey, right? So, yeah, um, it's, a, it's a bedrock realm for all the right reasons, right? And I just, I just installed Vanilla BD Craft, buddy. So... Oh yeah? Okay. I'm sorry to hear you're not uh, feeling too well. You're getting better is a good, good thing, that's for sure. Don't you quit on me. 
I feel like our journey just begun together. <laughs> I don't want it to go anywhere. All right, well, hold on a second. So if this is, this is where this is gonna go. Yeah, I gotta be honest with you, TikToks. My in my world, um, every, my life is trying to stop me from being a streamer. <laughs> but I keep fighting it, man. I keep up the the fight. <laughs> oh well, yeah, okay. Listen, you can come do some archaeology with me anytime, man. You'd be you would love it. The pay is about one eighteenth what you make as an accountant. But, uh, yeah, <laughs> you consider it. I'll show you how to dig a square, how to find some stuff. You might really like it. Let's plant some dark oak. This is spruce. Dark oak's up here. There it is. I'm just going to throw those uh, saplings down right now. They're not, this is not going to be the final product here. I don't have any, um, it's a survival realm and I run out of stuff all the time. So I don't have any andesite on me. <laughs> I can dig it. That's true. Another problem is that I have to raise the roof. Do you see what I did here? Right? I got to do that. Might as well get up there and do that right now. Raise the roof. So I hope everybody's having a great morning. Uh, next time I get some people watching TikToks, I'm definitely going to raid you. So I hope you're ready for a little bit of raidy. A little bit of the raiding. It's fun. And I like doing it to people. And I like sharing with my community some of the uh, gems that I find on Twitch, uh, you know. Yep, text. It's a vanilla BD craft. So BD craft, of course, pretty old school texture pack, right? It's been around a long time. And so they made a vanilla version that's available on the Minecraft marketplace. Uh, it's not cheap. It's like eight or nine bucks. Um, but we got it, and um, it's true to Minecraft, but with the vanilla, with the sorry, with the BD craft kind of style, right? Uh, gorgeous in every way. Absolutely love it, and I know in my realm uh, people are gonna love it too. So. This is going to be good, good stuff. I don't know how big I have to make this ridiculous raise the roof experiment here. Hold on. Without falling to my death. There we go. Just doing this. <laughs> oh no, I can't reach that corner. If you are new to my stream, uh, I'd like to say welcome. Please say hi in the chat. Um, we, we'd all love to meet you for sure. Uh, as you can see, I'm not efficiency miner. If you're looking for some like super pro tips, it's uh, you're probably going to get that from some of my viewers, but you're not going to get it from me probably because <laughs> I kind of just fumble around here. So, <laughs> If you're cool with that, I'm cool with that. How could... Talks. How can you possibly not be good at vanilla playing extremely complex Windcraft? <laughs> Those two things. <laughs> Alright, for now, this is getting filled in with wood. That's what I'll do. And I'll replace it when I can. It's an IOU. We're going to go up on this side. Just to widen this out enough here. I'm pretty sure I just saw an Enderman in my garden over there. Oh, yep. Yep. Okay. Let's try that again. There we go. I've done some modded stuff. I, I did play Java. I was, I was streaming Java initially. Uh, I was doing photorealism texture packs. 
my uh my plan for twitch started it's man let me tell you guys when i started doing this my plan was to play minecraft with you guys because i love it so and then um i have a really large record collection i know it's all blurred out in the back there but that's just a fraction of the amount of records that i own uh, 12 inch original pressing vinyls from the 60s 50s 60s 70s 80s 90s 2000s Right, I own so many records, really nice ones. I own a good turntable and a digital mixing board and all this stuff, right? So I'm not bragging here. I'm just gonna, I'm trying to tell you what I was, what I was gonna do. So the idea, the concept was, the concept. Well, I'm gonna come back to you guys. The idea was to play Minecraft, but also start the show by showing a record. Uh, um, it's Led Zeppelin III, it's Jimi Hendrix, it's Pink Floyd's uh, metal, it's, it's 1969, it's, you know, whatever, just to do a little talk about it, uh, and sort of educate people, uh, and, uh, and then we sit down and we enjoy that record together. Uh, I thought that would be brilliant, you know, and people would love it, and it's, it's, I own the vinyl, so I felt like it should be okay, but you can't play copywritten material on Twitch. You can't. There's just no way around it. Unless I got on the phone with Sony, EMI, like all the record labels, and said I need permission to stream your albums, uh, I would either... Well, I think the first thing would happen is that Twitch would have to remove me because I'm breaking copyright laws. Yeah. Hmm. Yeah. <laughs> that was the idea, man. It was a great idea. Uh, share a really famous album with you guys and then yeah honestly TikToks they they mute it they mute it because they don't want to kick you off Twitch but if you keep messing with their rules and regulations what choice do they have I guess you know in some ways I, I think um, I'd rather not break the rules around here there's been an upshot to it um, I can tell you that because I stream um, copyright-free music uh, here, I play it, it it's uh, off of a pretzel, if you're familiar with pretzel, so playing pretzel music here, um, I've heard and found a lot of new artists that are making really great music, right? Digging deep and, yeah, so, you know, there's there's a there's a plus to it, right? It's made me find some new music, right? And I'm good with that. You know what? Just in case this needs... I don't think it needs more torches, but I'm just gonna... Just in case, we'll do something like that, okay? And let's see if this thing grows. And I'm not gonna bone meal it. I'm just gonna let it happen. I don't know, uh... See, that's two away from that. Maybe I need to take this wall down, too. Really quick, guys. I'll just get up there. See? Widen out this ceiling just a little bit more here. Just in case. Something like that. Looks like I got a little diorite out of the deal, too. Maybe I can uh, finish that one little area there. <laughs> I love it. I love it. This axe is going to break. Might as well just make one now. Well, that sure is a pretty piano, ain't it? Ain't that a pretty piano going on right there? Hey, 
Need to say. Sounds good, man. Gonna deal with all that actually. Let's just use all of it up because I use it for all my lining down here, right? So if I don't use it now, I'll use it later. Ah! I knew there was one down here and you put it. That's right. That's right. Hey, Hyder. Good morning. Playing a little Minecraft with you guys. Hope you don't mind. Did that work? Nope. Oh. Grab the wrong pickaxe. This one goes back in there. Just doing a little bit of work on the underground farm. I'm popping in for just briefly, guys. I'm not going to hang out too long with you. I wish I could. But um, there's some things I want to do today. Involving uh, my little girl. And we're going to play some stuff. You know what I mean? Maybe some board games today. That looks great. All right. Hey, wait a minute. No. Sorry. This here. Right. <laughs> if anybody's new to the stream, say hi in the chat. Give us a little hello in the chat. We'd all love to meet you. Hey Jess, good morning. I decided I'd stream very early today. Um, find the time to do it, you know what I mean? Uh, this is an appropriate time for me to do this. and uh, I'm afraid I'll have to turn off pretty soon. I'll have to get off stream pretty soon. But um, yeah, the mornings are uh, a little less obligations going on. It's a good thing. There's not, nothing bad there. Lovely. So good. Alright, let's see if that grows. Let's see if these bad boys grow. Yeah, I won't ever I won't ever let you down, Jez. We're gonna play Minecraft all the time. You know that. You know that. Um, good news for you and uh, anybody who's new. I just wanted to tell you that this is a uh, it's a bedrock survival realm. Uh, it's paid. Uh, this is uh, a Mojang hosted, so it's a Realms Plus realm that you actually pay for um, through Mojang, you know, through your Minecraft. So it holds about ten people, and we got about ten people in the realm right now. Um, it is survival true blue. Uh, we have a texture pack on it. I just changed it up again to be um, the vanilla BD craft texture pack. All right, so. If you don't know, uh, if you don't know what that is, you're gonna find out because you're just gonna see it for yourself. You know what I mean? Um, beautiful, and I have this cranked by the way. This is set at 256 resolution, uh, which is for bedrock. That's the highest you can go, right? So, or at least currently, I don't know. Um, yeah. So basically, uh, just gorgeous, high res. Um, BD Craft is very cartoony, um, but. This v vanilla version of it is kind of pricey on the marketplace, about eight or nine dollars, but uh, it's more true to the original Minecraft, but with a nice touch, right? And I think you're gonna like what you see, right? Right on, Jazz. Yeah, I do that all the time. I, I um, on my phone, I'll cast a, a, a somebody's stream. You know, look at this guy. Oh, I see him. This is Cahill, aka Poisonous Taco. Who's <laughs> on on Twitch? He's known as Poisonous Taco, and he is a maniac Minecraft player, to say the least. 
These guys have very impressive builds. Uh, it'll be a long time until I uh, until I get to where they're at. Right on. So I'll, sh I'll tell you what, guys. I'll show you the house. Um, it's coming along uh, very nicely. Main floor. Let's just step outside here. Um, well, Jazz, I can tell you that if you're running Java, there's a lot of texture packs that are available. Um, look at this guy. <laughs> Um, there's a lot of texture packs that are available for free. Uh, you just go to a place like Planet Minecraft. Uh, PlanetMinecraft.com, I think, is the address. Uh, don't quote, don't hold me to that, but I'm pretty sure that's it. And uh, yeah, basically, you can download and install Java texture packs, and you just download them. Um, the Minecraft Marketplace sells them. Uh, the difference, I guess, is that you can access it anywhere. It's nice and clean and easy. Look at this. Oh, look at this. All right, here we go. You ready? Cahill, you're hilarious. All right, you guys ready? Here we go. Ah! <laughs> ah! <laughs> oh, hold on. There we go. <laughs> Very strange. Look at this thing. <laughs> it's insane. Oh, oh, dude. I think I just, for some reason, I pushed the button and they fell through the door. <laughs> Did I break it? I'm sorry, KL. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna finish my little tour here. All right, there's the house. It's coming along. That's a nether brick roof, which uh, this texture pack has a beautiful uh, tone to it, sort of a purpley red, right? <laughs> that didn't work. <laughs> Second floor here. All right, it's coming along. Enchanting room here. So nice. Right on, buddy, thank you. This, this here, um, when the nether update happens, I'll be using this. We'll just see, you know, if it gives me new nether through there, basically. And third floor, you can just see, nice little loft, right? Not sure what I'm going to put up there yet. Maybe just storage, but I, I don't know. Decorative, decorative storage. This is a little patio here. I didn't want this to extend right over it, but uh, yeah, I'll set up some chairs and things. Just make this look nice, you know, for the view of the village, right? Yeah. I gotta move this jungle tree. At some point in time, I have to take this thing down. And then all the seeds and things like that. It's gonna be a pain in the you know what. It's very large. Map wall of the realm so far. I'm sure uh, other people have uh, ventured farther than me. But um, uh, people have uh, basically, we made maps and we made copies of them. So as they're mapping, it's filling in my maps, right? And you can see here, there's some green pins, right? Just in points of interest in other people's houses and things like that, right? We are here. We're in this uh, green dot right there in the middle. So I've got access to this big, beautiful ocean, right? But also uh, there's a good swamp biome up here. Um, one of our realm members recently found a uh, um, mushroom biome, which is pretty far from here, but using the nether, it doesn't take too long. And that was really cool to see. Really, really cool to see. I'd never seen anything, but a bunch of mushrooms running around on it, and yeah, it just looked really good, you know? Yeah, excellent, for sure. Yeah, so a little bedroom, getting getting, getting around to decorating, right? So the bedroom's going to go here. I'm not too sure. I'm not, I'm not totally in love with this raised. Um, it's a little too heavy, right? I'll probably change that up to be wood and a little more subtle, right? Something... A little nicer because this is this is really heavy. Yeah, a little crafting area. Just do a few tools things, you know what I mean? I'll make something much nicer there, of course, too. This is going to be just a big hall. I think I'll put a little statue, put something something nice in the middle of this. So a carpet with a something to look at. Fountain could be nice, right? Yeah. 
And that's basically it for now, guys. That's that's what it looks like. I got a storage room downstairs here. This took a little while to build, believe me, but as as you fill it all in, you know? Survival realm, so you don't just get this stuff for free. Whole bunch of leather. That's a lot of that's a lot of item frames, eh? I'm sure you've seen bigger, but I'm pretty proud of this one. This looks pretty good. Tell me what you think of it in the chat there. Let me know what you think. This is um this kind of system basically you memorize it. It takes a long time, but you eventually get really used to where things are, and uh, you just start using it, and then you keep using it, and you d you don't move things around. Once everything's in its place, you know. Yeah, Jazz, that would be a really good idea. Um, right now, I'm not in love with this. I, I put down a polished granite here, and the combination of wood in this doesn't look good to me, right? I, I, I do want to change that. I'm not too sure, not too sure what just yet, but thanks, Jazz. I'm hoping that this can, um, I wanted all the types of wool sorted, right? All the dyes, you know. Oh, thanks, Gail. Ah! <laughs> Uh, vanilla BD craft, hey? Eh? Look at these. They look incredible. Whoa. How is he even doing that? Let's just watch the master at work here. Let's watch. <laughs> Do I have uh, anything I can put on them? Here's some iron leggings and leather boots. Oh. No. 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 What is happening? <laughs> Whoa, it's so crazy. I want my boots back. Give me my boots. There we go. I love it. They look so crazy. <laughs> this is like an art installation, eh, guys? <laughs> Let's give one of them a trident. There. There's a bunch of stuff over here, Kale. I don't know what's, uh, what to use, but... Give one of them a bow. You can do that. <laughs> it's impressive. I love it. No, I haven't seen any new power at all. Marching. Yeah. Hey, you know what? Jazz, good idea. Put a scarecrow in the garden. I know I have these underground ones, but it could look really good. I was also thinking of unleashing some cats down here so that it's sort of creeper proof, you know, because they don't like the cats. How's this coming along? Grass is still growing? Grass is still growing. All right. Good. <laughs> Hold on one second here. This dubstep is lovely. A little much for the morning, but good sound, eh? Yeah, that's true, but just picture like one. One cat, right? Oh no. There. Good enough.
Looking good, right? Something is gurgling so hard over here. That is not a good sound. Can't wait for the grass to grow so it's just this sound. See? It's pretty nice. Eh, cats are kind of antisocial sometimes. I'll get, a, I'll get a cat with a bad attitude. Doesn't want people around, you know? <laughs> that, that stuff hasn't popped yet. No surprise there, though. Right on. Cahill, thanks for coming over, man. Um, I do have to check out. It's time for the stream to end. I would love to send a raid if somebody else is streaming right now. Let's check. Let's let's take a look. Let's take a look and just see if we can go visit somebody streaming right now, right? No, not a lot of people on right now that I know. Yes, of course I would come see it in the future, man. Absolutely. <laughs> Thanks, Jazz. Yeah, today's going to be a fun day. The weather's, the weather's getting a little better outside, so... Okay, he'll take care, man. Thanks, thanks very much for coming by. Thanks for playing with me today, for sure. If anybody's new in the stream, thanks very much for viewing. Uh, I really mean that. We we really like it when uh, new people pop by here and say hello, you know. So, yeah, totally appreciate you. So, have a good one, guys. Um, I'll be seeing you uh, in the future. Not going to make any promises when I stream because of Corona thing. My stream schedule is kind of ridiculous. Um, I don't like inconveniencing my real life. Uh, and it's often this kind of thing that does. And it's a, it's a painful truth about it, right? So, um, yeah. Just uh, say hi in the chat. If you're new, follow. Set those notifications so you know when I'm back. And I'd love to see you again. I do stream other things. Um, I was thinking about just after this stream, I'll be streaming Mountain, which I know is a hit or miss thing for a lot of people. But if you're into something just on the screen, some nice tunes, some sort of uh, chill, chilled out tunes in a way, and you get to watch this mountain live and evolve, and the mountain thinks, and it's a very smart game. So I'll be seeing you guys in just a minute, just live streaming that, basically. Um, it's a mountain with some nice tunes in the background, so... You guys, uh, you guys might enjoy that, okay? It's growing on me. It is actually a very interesting, strange little zen experience, right? So take care, guys. Thanks for watching. I'll see you soon.